Let's talk about the president's agenda coming off that uh, that, that health care defeat. A word now that he wants to perhaps consider putting forward some sort of tax reform bill and infrastructure and advancing those things simultaneously. Is that a smart move? Big mistake. Big mistake, Craig. And this is what Washington always does. They pile bills on top of bills and they create these big Christmas tree bills. Look, the infrastructure thing is a big deal. That should be voted on on its own. And, and look, Craig, you know tax reform is a huge heavy lift that should be voted on on its own. My fear again is Donald Trump is taking his anger out on my fellow colleagues, the Freedom Caucus. I think he's still angry about uh, about what happened last week. Well, he's you, pointing you could understand why he might be. Yeah, but he's picking the wrong group of people. I mean, think about this, Craig. Uh, the Freedom Caucus, my buddies are getting a bum rap. You know and I know that liberal and moderate Republicans hated that bill as well. They were scared to death to have to vote yes for that bill. But Paul Ryan and Donald Trump, everybody's pointing at the Freedom Caucus because they're a much easier target to go after. Trump is giving signals that he wants to work with Democrats, even on health care reform. Yeah. Speaking of the Freedom Caucus, Joe, I'm glad you brought that up. At this point, any idea whether whether your your homeboys there in the caucus are going to vote to raise the debt ceiling? I I I cannot imagine. And that's going to be a fight, Craig. That's going to be another fight, and we're only a month away from this. If they See, don't look, raise it and the government shuts shuts down, you've got a Republican president, a Republican Senate, and a Republican House. One would assume that the blame would fall at the feet of the Republicans. Well, on that issue, Craig, on that issue, I can guarantee you the Freedom Caucus will probably be alone in making sure uh, that we don't just blow by another, uh, another limit. Look, they are the conscience of the Republican Party. I know they are a thorn in a lot of people's sides, but thank God for what they did this past week. They did the country a huge favor. Craig, nobody liked that health care bill. Nobody liked it. The president liked it, Joe Walsh. He said he did. And House Speaker Paul <laughs> he Ryan didn't know, said he liked Craig, it. Craig, he didn't know what was in it. President Trump didn't know what was in the damn thing. Congressman Joe Walsh. Uh, we should note a Trump supporter. Congressman, yes. uh, always good to have you, sir. Thank you. Coming Thank you. up. Thank you, sir. Uh,